Hi everyone, it's Christoph Chu from Coldwell Banker Global Luxury Real Estate in beautiful Beverly Hills, California. I want to take you on a virtual showing of this wonderful new listing I have in the Beverly Hills Post Office Area 90210. So let me take you around and show you. You first come here and you arrive at this beautiful double glass wrought iron entry gate and of course the incredible antique chandelier, which I love chandeliers, hopefully you do as well. These beautiful glass doors offer a lot of natural light. They're beautiful, ornate, wrought iron in design. And it pulls you right into the incredible hand-cut marble entry floors. Now what's great about the house, you walk in, you have the ceilings here that are probably about 30 feet over to our left or to our right when you walk in. Well, first we come in to see this beautiful mirrored console and again, the chandelier and the beautiful staircase. So you come in to the right from the entry door, and this is the formal living room. It's a really wonderful space. It's large. It's light and bright, although today it's a cloudy day. We have one of those May cloudy mornings. Instead of June gloom, it's May gloom. So it's a beautiful living room, high ceilings. There's a wonderful stone fireplace in the French style. Gas fireplace, so it's easy to use. Great French doors right here, which lead off to one of the outdoor dining areas. So you have this wonderful private outdoor dining area here off the living room. The house is completely surrounded by wonderful mature hedges, which is really terrific. So coming back in, you see here's the other view of the living room from where we came in. Beautiful Juliet balcony on that side, another picture window, another French door. So it's a nice spacious room, great to entertain, and with our weather beautiful most of the time, you can have the doors open and enjoy the fresh air. Here's a little different view of the entry vestibule. Very pretty. So that's the formal side, and then as you walk over this way, I would say it's one of the best family rooms I've seen in a long time. And one of the things I want to emphasize about this house, it's the best value in all of Beverly Hills 90210. So it's sit for about $720 a square foot. This is the family room, and that's Mushi. Dogs love it too. <laughs> He's very comfortable. Big picture window here on the west side. Wonderful television hidden by artwork, which closes gas fireplace. So it's a really big family room. And what's cool is that it opens directly to the kitchen. So it's a modern uh, open kitchen. The owners redid uh, most of the kitchen a couple years ago. Viking appliances, granite counters, wonderful stainless steel appliances. Great breakfast area, which overlooks the backyard. And they installed this wonderful wine cooler. So if you like wine, it's a perfect spot to get your wine easily accessible. <laughs> this is kind of the pantry area, the laundry room. And then we do have a guest bedroom here, which I guess could be a maid's, but it is the fifth bedroom. There's five bedrooms in total. This is the one on the first floor. Beautiful room. And has a lovely bathroom as well. I'll show that later on. Let's go back in. So pantry, laundry. And since we're already here, let's go take a look outside. It's a real resort style backyard. You hear wonderful birds, can you hear them? The birds are really singing today. You come out, there's a barbecue area, wonderful lounge. Birds singing, lots of beautiful palm trees. Wonderful flowers and roses. There's an outdoor fire pit. And then over to the right over there is where that uh, dining area was off of the living room. So you can see the outdoor dining room off the living room there below. About three, four steps above. So here's another view of the pool area. Oh, here's our fire pit. Nice to lounge on those cool evenings. Waterfall pool. Another dining area over there. So you can seat easily, I think, what, 10 people, which is great. You basically own the whole mountain. You've got uh, over half an acre of land. You can see our clouds up there today. <laughs> That's the private deck off the master. And here's the back view of the house. Lovely Mediterranean architecture with wrought iron. Double pane windows. The stonework was all redone by the owners. It's nice slate. And then there's your waterfall spa. So nice large pool. Oh, the sun's coming out. Good, you get to see a little bit of the sunshine. Beautifully landscaped and completely private. So no one is looking into your backyard, which is really a nice feature. People like privacy. And then here we go once again to the sitting area. Let's go back in the kitchen. 
Really a great floor plan. This house is listed for four million two fifty. dollars Oh, so here's the view from this side. So once again, the refrigerators, the breakfast area, the kitchen, center island. There's two sinks. There's one in the center island here, one over on the left. Then here's our Viking oven with all the stainless steel cabinets. And these really cool, I love these, kind of branch, twig branch um, handles for the cabinets, which kind of reflect the outdoor garden feeling. And then here's the other view of the main family room. Through this archway, there's lovely archways, by the way. You walk into kind of a semi-corridor. Here's the other view of the entry from this side into the formal dining room. Formal dining room is quite spacious. I love the beautiful, large ceiling medallion, porcelain chandelier, and once again, French doors, which lead to the outside, so it's easy to go in and out for your parties. Currently, it's a table for 10, but you could easily do 12. We do have a guest powder room right over there, and right over here, we have kind of the playroom, card room, game room. Uh, so you have these three very functional rooms right off of the backyard. So this also does have French doors, card area, cabinets, and areas to enjoy and relax here in the playroom. I want you to put down off of the uh, laundry area back over that way, there's a staircase that goes downstairs. There is a three-car garage. Oh, let's go on up and look. Three-car garage, and uh, you have a long gated driveway, private gate. You can see the hedges there in the driveway and the mountain above. And so we have a lot of parking. You can park easily about eight, maybe nine cars here at this particular property. Here's a view of the staircase going down. More lovely wrought iron. So there are four bedroom suites on this floor. That's a guest bedroom with the door open, master there, third bedroom, and then fourth on this side. But let's go right into the master. Very spacious master, and everything beyond these doors is all master suite. This is the master bedroom itself. There's an area for the TV, sitting area, Juliet balcony, high cove ceilings, lovely gas fireplace, which is always nice to have. And let's open the door, Mushi's bed. <laughs> Show you a little bit more of the backyard. Here we go in there, the sun's out, isn't that nice? So it's nice to open up your door in the morning. You can overlook the garden. The beautiful flowers. See how quiet it is? All you hear are birds and the flowing water. And there's your private mountainside behind. So again, no neighbors, complete privacy in this wonderful resort style backyard. Okay, let's go back in. Here's another view of the master. We came in that door. You could have a huge bed, as you can see, plus the separate sitting area. Now in through here is the kind of other parts of the master. Straight ahead is the master bath. To the right here, we have a gym, which is nice, or it could be an art studio. It's kind of an art studio gym for the owner. It does have a door into the master bathroom area. And you have a private terrace balcony out here. It's also quite nice. So in the mornings, you can sit out here, get some sun, which is now upon us. Read your paper, have a cup of coffee or tea, and just look at the beautiful garden below. So Jim, there are dual closets here. We have a nice large men's closet there. And here is the master bathroom area. As you can see, it's quite large. You have double sinks, full walk-in shower, sunken tub. You have uh, one toilet area there and one toilet area over here behind. And then you have a large walk-in closet there. Usually I don't show the closets. Owners often don't like their closet shown. <laughs> so, but here's just a, another sweeping view of the master bathroom. It's a really large space. And you have this nice hallway from the bathroom. Once again, gym on the left, second closet on the right, and back to the bedroom itself. 
Just so peaceful. Let's listen to the birds in the water. House is about uh, 5,900 square feet in total. So here's one of the guest bedrooms directly adjacent. Uh, dual zones of air conditioning has a little entry foyer into this guest bedroom. It's currently used as a kind of a den office upstairs. So it's again another spacious room. All the bedrooms are en suite and we do have a nice balcony. The closets are also quite large. So nice, this would be bedroom number two on the second floor. Nice, beautiful bathroom, all with lovely crema marfil marble. Hardly used, um, the owners live here by themselves, so there's not many people using the rooms. So here's another view of this bedroom. So once again, we have the master here to our left. The entry, I mean the hallway upstairs, the beautiful wrought iron and chandelier, picture window. So third guest bedroom here on this floor. Another nice spacious room, and they have big furniture, so if you put smaller furniture, it would even be more spacious. This room also does have a lovely Juliet balcony overlooking the backyard. More lovely views of the garden. And a lovely bathroom also with a similar crema marfil marble. Here's another view of the bedroom. There's room for a lounge in that side as well, another large walk-in closet. And then we have our fourth bedroom upstairs. This one also has a full balcony, and it's one more large room, also with an ensuite bathroom and big closet. Here we can see another sink, a nice big shower. So all the rooms here are large, they're spacious. It's very light and bright. Even though we started off with clouds, it's very light and bright. It's exquisitely maintained. And you know, for 6, 000, almost 6,000 square feet or 5,900 square feet on over half an acre in Beverly Hills 90210, for this price, you can't beat the deal. Everybody wants a good deal and this is one of them. So if you're looking to move to Beverly Hills, It'd be my pleasure to help you, Christoph Chu, and maybe this is the perfect home for you. Do you see yourself living in this home? If you do, give me a call. 310-777-6342, and thanks for watching my tour. Bye-bye now.